We are back at 514. A little foggy out there this morning, Todd. Little. <laughs> I mean, no, okay, hold on. Is a that, lot. Where did that, you drive from? Oh, is that the weather or is that you? <laughs> well, <laughs> but it, uh, well, yeah. A little both. A little both. Yeah. A little, a little this, a little that, some other stuff. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that we won't mention. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, the fog is, is an issue absolutely this morning. I mean, look at all the, the towns where the visibility is down around a quarter of a mile. So that's not very far. I mean, you know, that's, that's one lap around the track. All right, so you know it's going to be kind of tough out there early on, especially pre sunup when it's dark. Uh, temps are in the 40s right now. Mildest spot is Greenville, 49. Coldest spot is Berlin, New Hampshire, where there's lots of frost on windshields there. Temps 28. Warm front is shifting north. Cold continues to retreat up to Labrador. It's very warm all the way back through the lakes, but there is a front now back here, and that's still a couple of days away. But that will mark the end of this very warm pattern that we're in where we have been setting records and will likely see some more fall both today and tomorrow. Thick fog burning off by mid morning, but low visibility and a little mist out there creating wet leaves. A ton of oak leaves are coming down right now, so drive carefully. It'll be a little slick in spots. Lots of sunshine midday temperatures jump 60 degrees by your lunch break and afternoon looks awesome. Mostly clear, dry and warm. Although winds will turn lightly on shore during the afternoon and that'll cool coastal communities off toward the second half of the afternoon, three o'clock on. Here are the highs, normally 50, everybody above that. Only towns in the 50s will be Rockland and Bar Harbor and that's just barely. And again, because of that wind direction. But 67 degrees for Bangor, that would be a record. The record 65, so we got a new one today. Augusta, Lewiston, upper 60s. Portland 65 coming up short on the record and then you've got lower 70s feeling more summer like as you get over toward the New Hampshire border, central parts of York County, southern parts of Oxford County and then over into the lakes of New Hampshire and down through the Berwicks and across the border to Rochester. Yeah, it's going to be toasty record breaking 70s just about everywhere tomorrow. There's the record for Portland 64 that falls Bangor 68 that falls as well. Wednesday still mild, but clouds will increase in the afternoon. This is noon, still no wet weather, but by the evening these showers start to work in and we'll have some through the course of the night into Thursday morning. More importantly, temperatures drop. The end rolls in with much cooler air for the end of the week. Notice how much rain falls on the East Coast through Saturday morning. Tons of it through the mid Atlantic down through the Carolinas, South Carolina, Georgia there. For us, though, as that front moves through, looks like the heavy rain stays just south of us, gets to the 495 loop in northern Mass. Here in Maine, maybe a tenth or two of an inch of rain. That's it. Now, all that heavy rain to our south will be from the remnants of Ada, which is off of Naples, Florida right now. It's going to meander through the Gulf, maybe strengthen to a hurricane tomorrow or the day after, and then make a second landfall in Florida's Gulf Coast north of Tampa by the weekend. Marine forecast one to three footers, southwest winds five to ten knots. There's the seven day. We burn the fog off to sunshine. It'll be warm again, mid 60s. Tomorrow record highs, 70 to 75. Mid 60s again on Wednesday. That's Veterans Day. Some wet weather in the evening through Thursday morning, and then we'll start clearing for Friday. It's partly sunny and seasonable 52. And then over the weekend, a lot colder 40s on Saturday and low 40s on Sunday with some flakes likely in the air. Maybe some flurries or snow showers around, especially Sunday morning. Kind of interesting and what a big difference, you know, last weekend to this coming one yeah. will make. <laughs> the roller coaster ride. Oh, continues. gosh. All right. Thank you, sir.